What's up guys, Kenji YGO here with the next Ancient Gear video. Okay, this time we are running the Momorad engine to see if it would help a little bit with disrupting the opponent. I'm not sure if it's going to be too cloggy or anything, but hey, Momorad can go in anything. Let's do this! Let's go second because I don't know. That extra draw is good. It's good. You know how it is. You know how it is. I'm a cheesecake. Y'all make your cheese whiz. Yeah, yo. By the way, before anyone gets shocked in the comments for saying for me saying the N word, I'd like to apologize. Um, I am like half black though. Uh. Okay, so I'm gonna go for a first turn Chaos Giant. So if I discard, I can summon. I honestly don't wanna get rid of the Overload Fusion because there goes my second Chaos Giant play, mostly. So we're gonna summon out Wyvern, go for Wyvern's effect, get Box, and then other thing. And then polymerization everything in hand. Unless we get that. I can still make Chaos Giant. Uh, but basically, that's all. So it's either I make Chaos Giant or lose to something. So I think I should make. Chaos Giant. As much as I don't think it's a good idea, I'm going to make Chaos Giant. Because Chaos Giant brings the chaos. Yes. I wish I didn't get hit with that. Ugh, painful. Uh, once per turn, damage different zombie monsters destroyed if not destroyed. Okay. So I'm going to keep Hound in hand. Or am I going to? Now I'll use reactor. This is gonna be difficult, because I know his deck can easily deal with Chaos Giant, but I want you in the grave. Okay, so we drew him to polymerization, then we can go poly. Now we can go into you. Do I want to? Because if I go into Chaos Giant, then it's gone. I don't have a contingency plan. I think Ancient Gear Devil is the way to go. It's, it's probably not the best idea. But... The thing is, it's more sustainable to have on field because it floats. If it gets pasteled, then I am pretty much screwed. But I can always make another one. Another one. Okay, Zombie World. Um, all monsters on the field become zombie type, neither play can tribute summon monsters except zombies. Okay, so that's probably gonna bring out you. And then you're gonna get banished at the end. Hopefully he falls for it, attacks into it, and I summon up other reactor dragon in the deck. And then I can pop zombie world. Why are you still a machine? You're supposed to be a Zamber. Okay. So if you he's gonna run it over and then he's gonna pop whatever I bring out. Uh not what I want, but hey. Shit happens. So that's gonna get ran over. And then should I go into reactor? Um What's it called? If the a monster you control, your opponent's cards, effects cannot be activated till the end of a damage step. So that's not gonna help. Um We added the lost box. So I'm going to go ahead and special summon this guy so we can get a search. Yes. And 
then in terms of what we can search let's search out a golem and we should be able to make chaos giant next turn i'm glad i laid off making chaos giant this turn because now it's going to go ahead and pop it why not Brilliant, we drew into Reborn. So, we have pretty much got this. Hopefully. Take your 600 burn damage. It means nothing to me. And then we'll make. Oh, we can make you. Um. Okay, so this inflicts piercing damage. If this guy, your opponent cannot activate spell and traps. If this card is destroyed, you can special summon one ancient hero golem from your graveyard, ignoring its summoning conditions. Let's see. We could go for you, or we could go for you. But you are potentially less cards. So let's go for you. And then we will try and make. We'll, we'll do that so that we can put it on more damage as well. And then all of that's in the grave and we've got this. So that's all good. Now we're going to pile on some damage. It's going to get a draw out of it, which I do not fancy. But we can still do this. Okay. So it gets a draw. Then we're going to attack two more times. Okay, so this hand, so this game's actually going pretty well. I've been playing defensively because lately I've been going offensive with this deck and it's not been working. Um, I also added in the Molnarite engine and then it did not work in this deck. It just didn't. It, it kind of clogged more. It was either go for your big plays or go for Molnarite. And that card in my hand that's Molnarite could be something else that's much better. So I had to. Hopefully, we are good. What is this? Book of Life. Oh no, he's gonna banish Raptor, aren't you? Or oh, Golem. I would ban personally banish Golem because when you leave the field, um, you get a special. Yeah. Pretty much. So it's gonna bring that back. Now it says target. Okay, I am going to activate it anyway, just because it's for the fellow elves. Okay, hopefully, okay, he can do something. He can't attack, which is good. But now I'm in a te top deck in war, and it's like, ugh. And I wouldn't say, it, I would say a losing top deck in war. Because he's already got one in hand. And that is hectic as all hell. I've been up against a lot of zombie decks today. So he's definitely going to bring back Sage. And then he's going to. He's probably going to attempt to do something. But the thing is, he can't attack. He can attack with the zombies, but what use is there? Because you can only run over that unless he's making Nirvana High Paladin. No, wait, what? What is this? If this card is special, summon return any monster of zombie type synchro monster in your graveyard that that are banished or in your graveyard to the extra deck, then you can destroy the same number of monsters your opponent controls. Zombie if a zombie type monster you control would be destroyed by battle or card effect, you can banish one Shirinui monster. From your graveyard instead, you can only special summon Shirinui Sovereign Saga once per turn. That's not a bad card. That is not a bad card. It's a really good card. Okay, so. And. We bricked! But it was a good duel anyway. Well done. I'm gonna set this. Because it's still not game. 
doesn't have enough to kill me right 4000 yeah so that adds up to 4800 so it's not game but nevertheless this was a pretty good duel showing off that new shirinui stuff i definitely want to make a deck around shirinui's now because that's where it's at okay we have we bought ourselves another turn Effectively, our last turn. So, come on, heart of the cards. And, in return, so I can say, Destiny Queen. Okay, so he's gonna use to send another Natsuki. Okay, oh, he sent you instead. And, no, I don't want to chain him. Okay, part of the cards. Really? I... Wow. Now, that is what I like to call bad luck. Um, I'm... Oh, wait, I can't... Oh. GG, mate. That was pretty interesting. Oh, you do get an effect when you banished. Yeah. The more you know. Boom, 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 boom. But still, yo, that was hectic. Hopefully, the next duels will not be as bad as that. I don't know why I'm talking like that, but I'm going to stop. Ugh. Well done. Well done, I like this deck you've got. And I didn't know Shirinui's got a new suit though, that is flipping awesome. So it goes from Shogun Saga to Sovereign Saga. Okay, that is all the time I have for today. Hope you guys enjoyed the vid. And um, let's hop into how the deck looks. And Okay, so in the end, I, mani I, I took out the Momorak engine. It's not even in the side book anymore because there's no space. So none of them are there, but I took out the Momorat engine because it just wasn't good. It just was not working out whatsoever, mainly because with the Momorat, it's like you have Momorat or you have the rest of your hand. You can use the rest of your hand or you could just use Momorat. You can't use both, so it's not like hundreds, unfortunately. So basically, this is the version I'm going with right now. I might take out Double Cyclone and put in another Solemn maybe, or I take out Double Cyclone and put in another Catapult. Um, so guys, one more thing, thanks for watching, I really appreciate you checking out my vids and all of that. Um, hit like and sub if you're new to the channel, or if you're old to the channel, hit, just hit like, I don't know, if you want to. Um, also clicking on ads helps me out quite a lot. And I'd like to thank you. This is Kenji YJO signing in. See you in the next one. Bye!